Alright, I'm back from um, a whole day of adventuring. My friend Mackenzie came over and we went to go get dinner, Mexican food of course, and um, I asked her if it would be alright if we could take my clothes to Daisy Exchange. And she said she was okay with that. So we took my whole laundry basket and we went to um, Daisy Exchange on the, down the road. Actually, it was kind of funny because we went to their old building where they still had the huge sign that was like, Daisy Exchange, we're going to buy all your trendy clothes. And they had me, for those of you who have never um, resold your clothes, they like make you fill out the sheet with all your personal information and with Daisy Exchange I actually had to stay in the store the whole time they were going through my clothes so I was walking around and stuff and Daisy Exchange actually seemed really nice like they had a lot of clothes that I would actually look at and their prices were pretty good um unfortunately they didn't buy a single one of my clothes so that was kind of a bummer but um I was like Kenzie do you mind if we also stopped by Plato's Closet and she was like, no, I don't mind. So we went to Plato's Closet and, you know, I was thinking they're not going to buy anything if Daisy Exchange didn't buy anything. Plato's Closet isn't going to buy anything. <sighs> and I have actually gone to Plato's Closet before and they only gave me like $5 for a whole laundry basket full of stuff. So I was like, whatever. Um, but they told us, you know, to go away for an hour and then come back. So, Kenzie and I actually went to Ulta, and I have my little, my little bag. Um, I've never been to Ulta before, so this is my first time. Shout out to all the YouTube people who've taught me what to and not to buy. Um, I ended up buying the Benefit Poor Professional right there. I've heard a lot of good things about it, and I swatched it on my hand, and it didn't feel greasy, so that's exciting. Um, and then I bought some nail polish remover because my nails are gross. And I bought um, this stuff. It's called um, Sun Bum Conditioning Mask. And it's got a little monkey right on top. It smells like banana. And um, it says you'll put it on your hair after you wash it and then leave it on for two to three minutes. No, 15 to 20 minutes, and then you'll rinse it. So I like hair masks, especially since I color dye my hair, because then they, um, my color stays in my hair. It doesn't get gross. And then I also, it was buy one, get one 50% off, so they tricked me, and I got this leave-in hair treatment. Um, it's got coconut oil, banana pulp, banana peel, banana leaf, quinoa, I don't know how to say that, proteins, and sunflower seed oil. And, um, it's going to detangle and condition my hair while enhancing and restoring its natural body, controls fizz, prevents split ends, slows color fading, and will leave your hair silky smooth and shiny. So, um, this looks really cool. It also smells like banana, which is cool. And... I think if I like these products, when my mom comes up next weekend for Mother's Day, I'm going to let her try them. And if she likes them, I'm going to give them to her because she is obsessed with banana. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to give these ones to her. I'll go buy her some more. <sighs> but anyway, so that's what we did while we were waiting on our Play-Doh's Closet um, friends to go through our clothes, my clothes. And... <laughs> Uh, when we went back, they were finished, and I got to, um, they found my little basket, and they had actually bought some stuff. Mackenzie had bet that they were going to buy, um, between zero and five items and give me four dollars, and I said that they were going to buy between zero and five items and give me two dollars, but it turns out, I don't really know how many that they bought, but, um, they gave me $20, I mean $19.15 or something, but, so that was cool, so that was round one. The rest, of course, I just donated to Goodwill, because honestly, the whole point is just to get rid of all of this stuff, and I don't want to throw it away when there are people out there who could use it. Um, I might try to research and see if I can find 
um, another free clothes closet. I know like there are food pantries, so I wonder if they're like clothes closets. There were in my hometown, so well, that's gonna be what it is. Um, hopefully my closet will be completely empty. I'll try to take a before picture, but the light uh, bulb, the light bulb in the <laughs> In the closet, it doesn't work. It's uh, burnt out and has been for like months, and I am too short to change it. So I will try to change it, try to take a picture so I can show you guys the before and after. Other than that, um, I'm super excited to try all of these products from Ulta. I also bought um, a sports bra from Old Navy. So pretty eventful day. I should not have spent all that money, but I made $20, so it's <laughs> it's not the same. Um, okay, but thanks for watching, you guys. Um, I'll catch you next time.